that beautiful or what? Ooh. Hi, I'm John Hartman from Durango, Colorado. And today I'm gonna to show you my big 10 inch. Uh, we're gonna show you what this thing can do. It's amazing, it's amazing. Come on back. This is my big 10 inch. It's a 10 inch diamond saw and a rock saw. And we use water to cut rocks. And this is a 12.6 pound chunk of Crystal Bisbee. Uh, there, it's probably the largest known in, in, uh, in America, uh, Crystal Bisbee. And uh, I've only seen two big pieces in my life and I've owned them. Uh, and uh, uh, this, this is a marvelous stone and uh, uh, I'm gonna cut it up and turn it into cabochons, Leah and I and, and Sky, and uh, we're gonna sell cabochons and these will be the last of my Crystal Bisbee. And believe me, uh, it's, 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 it's valuable stuff. There is so little of it and Bisbee's the number one known turquoise mine in America. Here we go. Look at that one. Is that beautiful or what? Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at the ribbon. Lots of ribbon. <laughs> that's something else. Imagine this is this seam here. This was probably a big long seam and for how long, how far back, who knows? But maybe, maybe it was five foot long, maybe it was 25 foot long, the seam of quartz with the turquoise going through it. And uh, somebody had the, the, the thought of, of taking this out before it got shoveled up and went through the crusher or wherever it went from there. But this is the only one that's shown up in 50 years that I'm aware of. And gosh, anybody who's had Bisbee knows of John Hartman. I've had ads in the antique trader the shotgun news the indian uh indian trader and so i'm i'm pretty certain there's there's hardly any there may be a couple people that might have have a piece but uh, uh not not good chances